So I'm going to lunge for those biceps right away. Okay? okay. I lunge, and I have to be able to come up, you see, in one movement. I'm not going to go. Okay? You have to figure out where your mass is that you can do this. Okay? And then you climb. So grab me. You see? You're pushing down, okay? And now you're gonna pry, but you gotta take away that base, okay? And you have to take tension away, so it slips, you see? I'll show you what I mean, okay? There's a lot of tension, I'm holding them up in my leg, okay? Well, I start bringing this in from its leverage point, and then I just kind of relax. Do you see that? Yeah. Did you feel it? Yeah. I don't have to do it long. I just have to re reduce the friction that comes from the tension. Do you get it? Yeah. Otherwise, I gotta push a lot as opposed to just clear the leg and control the leg for the homolateral knee slice. Got it? Yes, so I go one, up, two, it's done. Okay, I'm on, I'm low, and I secure, okay? I'm not letting go of that hook, and I'm not letting go of this hook here, okay? My weight is on him, so he moves whatever. It's not so easy, okay? And I'm loading this leg. You feel that? Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I'm going to do the same thing. So I load the leg. What's he want to do? Yes. And I do the same thing on the other side. Secure the leg. Got it? Yes, sir. Right. When I say I do the same thing, is I release the tension, the friction will go away, and it just slips off. Okay, try it again. Okay, so what we're working on is that release of, of tension, okay, that you, you, you use it. So I'm coming up, boom, release, down I go. And he's, he's not going to just let me die for that, do you see? Okay, so a couple things to realize. But, uh, you would just want one frame. I mean, do whatever you, whatever you, okay, so he has two frames there, you see? Okay, the first thing to realize is that his strength is in his elbows this part of his arm, okay? See there? Like here's where he's very strong, but here he's not very strong. And he, had, he made the mistake of putting his hands together. So when I drop it over here, do you see? Yes, you have it, and now I can come into that same technique. Okay, so let's go to a little bit more. I'm here. You framed. Don't, you're gonna to wanna to push on that. Don't push on it. Don't push there, yield there, yield there. And then the other shoulder comes down, you go on the hands. And then you come in, okay? That's why like when he's up, up your, your power's not in your hand, it's in the, this upper arm. The upper arm is where you're doing. Okay, the upper arm. The upper. Okay, got it? Let's try it again. Okay. You, you could always knock it off, but I want you to, to learn the yielding. Okay, see his fingers right here? Just like his hands are to his elbows, his fingers are to his wrist, okay? So what I'm gonna do is go around it this way. Can you guys see that? Yes, sir. Okay, and I'll back step. Go around. And then, you are right. Yeah. A lot of times you get that wrist lock, so be careful. I shouldn't have done it that fast. It's this wrist lock. Same move. 
There it is. Just come around this way. So you find side, from side control, you'll have that protected. All right, just drive it up and over. And we're back with it. Okay. Ready to go.